are the Macedonians or Greece, Greek. And in modern day times, no, they're not. But ancient times, they are. Those people still think I'm separate. But yeah, they're separate, just like uh, the Ath Athenians and uh, Spartans are separate. Uh, the Spartans and Macedonians come from the same people, the Dorian tribe. The Athenians come from a different one, actually, though. Okay, where'd that guy go? Over here. He's in here, isn't he? Whoa, no, 79% now. I'm not taking that chance. Mary Adok. That's a cool name. Ready to ambush. That's what I like to hear. Let's see, um... There's not much going on here. I wish there was more. I could almost build some Hastati in this uh, area. My main reason for wanting boats here is so I could uh, get quick units quickly from over here to over here. Because these guys are going to have to walk, unfortunately. Alright, so... Let's see if uh, the people of Aquincom will like you. They don't seem to mind. It's a good sign. That's a good sign. Alright. You can all I should build a watchtower here. The cavalry will come in handy. Historically the Romans never conquered the Germans. From uh, basically the Romans have gone all everything up to what I have. Minus some territory around this area. Maybe even all the way up to this territory, but they pretty much conquered over to here and they followed the river, and that's where their border was kept at this river. Though there have been times when the empire stretched as north around here and all that stuff. And even times where the empire stretched up following this area, but there's always been a little ditch around here. And over here, the Empire seemed to follow this river. Ah, uh, like this river to this river. There's a time in between these rivers that the Romans did invade here. And then you have what happened at the Battle of Teutoburg. Uh, where, uh, let's see, a rogue uh, Roman general, who is uh, German by uh, birth, uh, betrayed, uh, let's say, Varus. We lost four legions in the forest, I think. Four legions, that's a lot. Well, the Germans attacked me once. They won't like it when I attack them. Oh, -ho! wow, they are prepared. I just want to come down here too, but they need to be punished. I'm going to strip them down in the underwear. I'm going to put on some leather, get time to the bedposts. You know, whip the crap out of them. That's the punishment they deserve. Alright, let's end my turn. And so far in all my campaigns, uh, France has been one of the uh, focal points. Being uh, the Britons needed to conquer Gaul as well. And as did the Romans. So far I've paid little attention to France overall, but that's about to change. The Greeks want ceasefire. Uh, I don't, so go away. You're not getting no peace out of me. All right. Um, Seventy-nine percent is not enough for me to risk it. But I'm gonna come back here with my uh, spy. See where Bellinus went. Looks like he's right over there, actually. Yep. All right, now Rhenoric. Ooh, faction heir. He's coming with an army. Good thing I got an army coming this way. 
Ooh, he wants to attack me. Both three of these. And to be safe, I will take one more unit of this. Now you need to get over here quickly now. Quickly, quickly, underlay, underlay, quickly, quickly. Send three uh, units along with him. Send three guys here. Two guys. And three cavalry. Um, move down here. Alright. We're gonna get ready to come over with them. Seems the rebels have stayed out of my territory since I put this guy here, so. That's a good sign. That's a good sign they ain't coming back. I have a feeling that they're gonna get ready to ambush me, so. I'm gonna play a little bit safe. Oh great, I also have a bonus when commanding uh, mercenaries, which is good. Rick Burgess. I will stand here in my defense. And they shall die. And they shall enjoy dying too, because death is an enjoyable thing. It only happens once. You might as well enjoy it, you know what I mean? Now build units here. Which means uh, the area down here is no longer uh, an area of my pussy armies, but now my better, less pussy armies. So, <coughs> Mastodon's moving up into Dacia and and Thrace. It looks like they haven't done much moving, but I think I saw some of them moving up there. Oh, you want a ceasefire now? It's too late for that. Can you not respect our two warrior cultures? coming together on the battlefield <laughs> all right town grows Batavium which is the future side of Venice I end up I end up saying a lot of these things because it's a long time since I do some of these things but should build that history facts are my favorite so if you don't like it get over it this is a Germanic large town. The capital is more than likely this one. Yeah, it is. Whoa. One more. Just so that they can really suffer. They're gonna suffer all right. So I have moved north more than any historical Roman oh Belenus is in there I thought he would be oh yeah I need to move this guy along which has some cavalry to be with him oh he does I didn't see those Alright. I got some very good stuff going for us. And we you guys get another battle right now. Way to go. Way to go for you guys. And while it's loading, I'm gonna go grab me a bottle of water, so I'll be back in a second, guys. <laughs> 